AZM Awards with my husband, Drew Baldrich. I love it. How are yeah. you? Uh, I'm good. We actually got an annulment, but I'm not holding it against it's him. It's all right. Yeah. Okay. We, it, just, it just didn't work. We had a lapse of judgment. We're in Vegas, after all. <laughs> but I wish you the best with your music career, Drew. Thank you. Thank you. It's, it's going all right. Yeah. It's going all right. <laughs> Drew's got a great song out. It's called Dance With Ya. And uh, it made me fall in love with him. That's why we got married. But, yeah, he danced with another girl. That's why I had to. That's what happened. Yeah. It's all good. It's all good. Drew, um, so you're busy. You've been yes. so busy. Yes, we're very, very busy. We, you know, we signed our record deal on October 8th. Mm -hmm. And uh, I think, you know, for about the past six months, I bet I've only been in Nashville 10 or 15 days. Yeah. So we've been out on the road. Pushing the single, playing tons and tons of shows, and you know, just really having a good time building dance with you. And uh, you know, we've been really, really lucky that a lot of stations like this are jumping on board and playing my song. I mean, as an artist, it's all you dream of is to one day have your music and to have that opportunity. And I mean, here we are. I mean, look around, look at all these talented people out here. I mean, and I'm here. What? What is this? It's all because of those dance moves. Yeah, I guess. I don't yeah. know. He danced his way here. I don't know. That's, I guess I guess so. He danced his way to the wedding chapel, <laughs> too. And then to the divorce court. There it was. <laughs> <laughs> what do I get? 50%? That's right. Yeah. Oh, I don't know. I don't know about all that. <laughs> well, Drew, you just wrapped up a tour with Granger Smith. How was yeah, that? Yeah, it was so much fun. We were out all the month of January with Granger. Played out shows all across the West. And it was my first time out West. So, to be out there, you know, I'm from a little town in Illinois. And out west, there's a lot more mountains and a lot more hills, so it was beautiful. I got to see land I never ever dreamed that I would get to see. And, um, you know, Granger's a really great guy. And to be out on the road with him and his whole band was so great to my band. We pulled lots and lots of pranks on each other and uh, just had a great time. And, you know, I was lucky that my first tour was with somebody like him that really took me in and really helped me out. Yeah. Did you get any tips from Earl to this junior? Yeah, I, one, I came out on stage one time dressed up and I, I had my, you know, overalls on and everything. And he came out to the front and he said, I'll tell you what, since we got Earl Baldridge out here, he said, I think we need to take a dip. What do y'all think? And I don't dip, you know, I don't chew. So he pulls it out and everybody starts screaming. I was like, oh, and everybody starts screaming at me. All right. So I took a dip on stage with him. We both took a dip and I had to sing with him. It was just a whole thing. How did you get through I just ran off stage and immediately <laughs> threw it in a cup. <laughs> well, what's in store for you this summer? So we got my, my new album's coming out June 10th. It's going to be called Dirt On Us. Uh, you know, I'm very, very excited for everybody to hear this album. There's going to be a... There's gonna be some songs like Dance with you, some grooves and and uh, and things like that. But you know, there's a couple of songs that are taking me back to my roots, back to my hometown. Where I grew up. We got a song called Tractors Don't Roll. That, uh, exactly how I grew up on Sundays, in a little bit of town and uh, you know farming and things like that. And so I'm just super stoked for everybody out there to hear this album because I think there's gonna be a little something. For well, I'm excited to see Drew come and dance some more with WKML. I can't wait. I can't wait. Yeah, we might go on to marriage number two. What do you think? Maybe, maybe. I don't know if you're trying to take 50% of it. I don't know how we're going to do that. <laughs> Drew Baldridge, thanks so much. Thank you. Have a great time at the ACU. Thank you so much.